at an elevation of 1,700 meters in southeast Turkey. And what you're seeing behind me is these Turkish commandos whose responsibility is basically to uh, patrol the mountains and the hillsides around this particular Turkish position that's very near the Turkey-Iraq border. And their goal is to secure these areas from any threat posed by the PKK terror group. The Turkish military says that these operations are ongoing to secure these areas and to prevent any kind of infiltration from the PKK terror group. The operations against the PKK terror group are ongoing and the numbers of people who are joining the PKK terror group and who are still active with the terror group in Turkey are dwindling. And that is thanks to these kinds of operations that are securing these places in southeast Turkey that have suffered from decades of terrorist activity by the PKK and now the people that we're speaking with and the soldiers that we're speaking with here uh, say that the situation has improved significantly and safety has returned to the many villages that surround these areas. Civilians feel safer in their homes. They don't feel pressured by the PKK, uh, PKK terror group. They don't feel like they need to join the PKK terror group as was the case in the past. Now, uh, because of the military advances that the Turkish military industry has made, including the production of drones, the production production of a uh, national rifle, the MPT. These kinds of advances in military technology are allowing the Turkish military to have the upper hand in these areas and to secure these areas so that people can go on living their lives in peace.